Osio child like trust be converted you know and become like a little child Yeshua said that unless we did so we could not enter into the kingdom of heaven There is a lot in those statements. I mean, if you think about it. Now, one thing that is universal and always has from, and, and it, it, it is the same throughout time when it comes to children. All right. You know, unless someone goes tampering with them, and then the child's innocence is gone. Uh, whether, you know, that's physical or mental, they, they mess with these children's minds especially. And a lot of times, you know, people, you know, talk about child molestation in, in physical forms, and that's worldwide, and this happens on them, which is a sad, tragic thing. But even more tragic, or just as tragic, well, let's just say just as tragic, it seems is that the fact that people will molest the minds of the children. You talking about sexually? No. no. Well, they probably do that, but that's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about they, they mess with the, the minds of the children to where they lose their innocence. They, they no longer have any kind of a, a, a trust or, or, or faith. You know, they don't have that. Well, remember when we was children? You know, uh, now it's not the same for every child, every family. This I know. I don't delude myself on that. Okay, but generally when a child has a hero, whether it was their parent, their uncle, a comic book, character or what they had their faith in that character or that person and they could do no wrong and whatever was said they believed with all their heart right well the Lord said we should be converted to be changed become like little children or we could not enter into the kingdom of heaven. The kingdom of God. Well, what, what are you going to... I mean, well, let's just take a look at something here. Trust and faith. A lot of people question God. They, and I even see that amongst believers or someone who's supposed to be believers, then the question is, are they then a believer? Because, think of it, it's like an oxymoron. Believer. Unbeliever. It don't match. It's like two opposites here, right? And they're like trying to be forced into one. It just won't. It's like trying to mix oil and water. It don't. Well, either you believe or you don't well it's like people you know uh, are constantly questioning God questioning his authority that's not childlike that's not faith that's not trust either you trust him or you don't Either you believe what he said, or you do not believe what he said. Now, when the Lord speaks, anything he says, it will happen just the way he says, and it will come forth. But it won't happen the way you, or I think it will, it will happen the way he says it will happen, and it will happen in his own time, not before, not after, but in his time on time uh, you remember when you was a child to trust in the Lord yeah 
trust everything that he says, says that he would do. That is a good question for you know for you to ask yourself. Have you become like a child in your faith, your trust, and gentleness and humble as a little child? You know, a lot of people don't stop to really think about that. I'm too much of a man. I'm too much of a lady. I'm too... You know, I'm all grown for it. No. Become. I'm not talking about going, not not like the way old uh, Nicodemus, you know, he thought, well, you know, the Lord said, well, be born again. Why well, can it can it be possible one go back into the womb? No. <laughs> no. You know, I'm not talking about going back and being that little child again, you know, uh, as far as... <laughs> no, no. Become have that faith that that gentleness that that all trust and that love you know that's what I'm talking about but see a lot of times we allow other people to challenge us challenge us on things to question us now all right I'm just going to give you an example, just to give you an understanding of what I'm, I'm, I'm talking about here. Okay, alright, let's suppose someone starts crushing, challenging you to prove the, the existence of God, for instance, okay? Alright, now, when you was a child, alright, and let's suppose now, as a child, someone, uh, now let's say, for instance, you believed... Uh, let's make up a uh, uh, Spider-Man, okay? Let's say you believed in Spider-Man. You know, he was real. You know, Spider-Man's real. He's, he's it. He's the cat's meow and all that kind of stuff. The bee's knees, whatever. All right. So, someone come up and challenged you about him. What would you have said? Think about it. What would you have said? Or if they uh, spoke against your 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 Papa, or, or something, you know, maybe your papa was constantly away, but you loved your papa, right? And, or maybe it was your mama, or something, you know, maybe they were always on business, and stuff, but you loved them, and you, you know, and someone tried to give you something negative, or something. What would you have said? Well, okay, now, now you, as a believer, with childlike faith and trust, isn't the fact that. He is. He is. He. You just know he is, and that's enough. You know. Uh, I know you have to uh, talk to people uh, and and help them and guide them when they're really hungry. But a lot of times, people when they challenge young things, they don't believe. They don't intend to believe. You know, if God is really uh, dealing with their hearts, you will know it. And they will know it. <laughs> Eventually, they'll know it. But uh, but mainly these people who uh, are this way, they they just don't have no interest in it. God's not tugging on their heart. They're just wanting to start a fight. You know, it's like uh, those uh, kids. You know, the children who believe in Santa Claus. When someone tried to, I could remember when I was real little. You know, well, not that little, but you know what I mean. Yeah, I was, and someone tried to tell me Santa Claus, my brothers tried to tell me Santa Claus wasn't real, but I was just, ooh, yeah, cross that line, mm-mm. Oh, you know, and then I cried and cried when I found out he wasn't real. <laughs> but anyway, uh, let's have trust like a little child, okay? Let's trust in them more. Shalom. God bless you all, and thank you for your responses. Thank you. Help me with the books and continue. I, I want all that information. I'm still looking. God bless you. Shalom. Ho.